Hey guys, we started another job. Um, dredging this time, very fresh and um, frosty morning. Um, we started yesterday, only just setting up the job. I'm gonna show you around what we've done so far. Uh, we got the 120 long reach, uh, we got the M-Fib here, and we got two truck dumpers to do the job. So, uh, as you see, that's the job itself. A huge pond, <coughs> sealed it up completely. <coughs> The long reach already loading the dumpers what we done yesterday is obviously just to get the machines here we got the tipping area sorted and uh, there is a, a slew gate here where all the water runs out and uh, I show you how deep it is oh yeah there you are way down there so what I done so far, I just went in yesterday. I don't know if you can see it from here. I just went in there yesterday and I went across here and I dug a ditch there. There's a ditch line there, it goes all the way. So I dug it deep, water constantly running here. Anyway, I managed to dug it quite deep, so I dropped the water table of the pond and the water should slowly soak out of this seal obviously we start moving it so haven't got too much time but you know any little water helps um, if it goes away because it's just easier to move right my machine is already running warming you up believe it or not it's still got a bit of ice here so yeah frosty mornings uh, it's nearly May quite quite impressed um, anyway uh, yeah, I'm gonna set that. I've got a time lapse camera set up for you guys, so uh, I'm gonna stick that on as well. And um, yeah, get started.
So here we are, um, that's the last day of the job, everything went all right. Uh, we had a few hiccups with the dumpers, um, just some usual tear and wear and fixing stuff and stuff like that. Uh, overall it all went all right, so uh, like I said that's our last day. The actual dredging itself is done, uh, we're just tidying up today, do some landscaping, putting some fence, uh, fences back up and stuff like that. Um, and yeah, uh, here we are. That's how the pond looks like. That's the slugia there, I just blocked it up this morning. Uh, and here is the pond itself. It looks way bigger than it was. It's all cleaned up. We've got average four feet water in there. Uh, it will be. Uh, so yeah, like I said, it's an average four feet deep everywhere. And uh, now we're just gonna tidy all the mess that we made. So uh, the owner actually liked the fact that he can, she can walk along here. Uh, so we're gonna keep that flat, you just landscape it, uh, blend it back into the field here. Uh, do the same here, put some topsoil in there. Uh, that's where our whole road was. Uh, you can see the dumpers are destroyed. We had a fire here just to burn up some rubbish. Um, so we're gonna tidy all this up, etc. etc. The boys up there cleaning the truck dumpers. Uh, the long reach up there cleaning up the fields. So yeah, exciting day. Uh, like I said, it's the last one and it's a Friday, we're in schedule. So happy days, happy days. Customer happy, we happy. Uh, so yeah, that's winning. Uh, I like when things are going all together nicely. Um, Tommy's coming back soon with the chainsaw and gonna clean up some trees over there and stuff like that just to make it look like, uh, look better, uh, nicer for the eyes to look at. Um, and yeah, we deal the seal, we build the seal trap there, which is worth a look. So technically speaking, uh, that's continuously running here, it's a stream there, it's like I said, it's an old meal pond earlier, and uh, it just seals out very quickly, considering basically, we're talking about years, but um, uh, here, basically, we just dig a deep hole and a wider bit, so when the water comes in down the street, it slows down, and drops the silt and clear water goes along uh, but to slow it down we did build this kind of dam now the dam it's actually not a dam it's just some abstraction to slow the water down so the water will run through this but it will make it slow down and the silt should start first of all start building up here and then it narrows down here so the water speeds up again here then goes into the pond so like I said it should start building up seal first here and uh, now it's easy enough to get here with any sort of digger and scoop this out every year or every second year and that should buy a lot of time lifetime for that big pond here well that's better 
we done here boys it's Friday afternoon all the gear is parked up here as you can see all I have to do is get that machine out there and we done so let's do that and uh, from the cab you can see what we done what this look like